This is a gold finger banana. They grow really prolifically in South Florida. They're a great alternative to the Cavendish banana, but they ripen very quickly, so that's why you won't see them commercially grown. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's a good flavor banana, and the great thing about this banana is that um, we harvest a rack almost every week because they just are so healthy out here in South Florida. The inside has a slight orange color, and it tastes a lot like a Hawaiian apple banana. This is a Pitogo banana, also known as fig banana because it looks like a fig. It's very short and stubby, but it has an amazing flavor. It's a dark orange on the inside, and it tastes subtly sweet, and has a creamy texture. This is a Maiswa banana, also known as apple or baby banana. And the amazing thing about this banana is that it tastes like a green candy apple. It has a thick texture and is perfect for smoothies and banana ice cream. This is a Brazilian banana, also known as apple banana in Hawaii, and it's a common banana variety that you'd find at a farmer's market in Hawaii. It's also very common in Brazil, hence the name Brazilian banana. It has a slight orange tint on the inside and tastes a lot like apple candy. This is a praying hands banana and it has the name praying hands because it looks like a pair of hands praying. So as you can see, these bananas are fused together, so you want to wait until it's 100% ripe before eating. And the way you can tell when it's ripe is the tips will begin to blacken and triple. So now we can peel off one piece and as you can see, it sort of unpeels itself from the pack. And the texture is super creamy, like a marshmallow. Really good flavor and amazing.